We're out at this uh, little ditch spot, slash tunnel spot. There's a cinder block ledge, some local kids have built. I don't know if you guys are kids, but yeah, you guys told me about this spot, so not a bad little spot. We're in the shade, so we're out of the uh, harsh California sun. I'm gonna get a few tricks on this thing and then, yeah. Shoes are pretty big too. Well, they're not too bad, but more or less the grip on my board. So I'd been through this tunnel a long time ago, before this was here, kind of checked it out, but I didn't think to build down here, but yeah, shouts out to the, the dudes that built this one. Not a bad little spot, just got to bring a broom and sweep it out because it doesn't rain much in California. What would be sick is like some transition. <laughs> Keep saying that, but yeah, that would be dope, I think. Everybody keeps asking when I'm going to build another DIY, truth is I just haven't found any spots suitable, you know. I mean, I could build here, but it's kind of a mission to get to. You gotta jump a fence and walk all the way down the drain, but <laughs> I kind of want to build somewhere that's like away from houses. This is pretty close to like houses up here. So I'm trying to find somewhere that's like flat, there's some shade, it's like away from the public eye, and then I'll start building again. You should be more funnier. How am I going to be funnier? I'm bummed because my ankle's still, it's not broken, but it's not 100% either, so I'm still waiting for my ankle to get better. It's really, it's really uh, playing with my emotions, you know? Oh, so you can see a lot brighter on the phone, look. Where all this sand come from? From the mountain, when it rains? Look at this piece. M-Y-E-R-S, Myers, is that what it says? Yeah. Pretty cool piece. I see this guy everywhere style this place is bomb look at it and it's a portal to hell what are you doing <laughs> look at this throwy sheesh <laughs> that's sucky i'm rushing 
this one, I can tell. Yep. <laughs> you can't even read it. Except on this back to them. Come on, hop over. This. This is the most dangerous spot of the fence to hop, as you can see. Come on! Why don't I just hop where I hopped in? Ah. I did it! I had this package come in this morning, gonna open it up. I still haven't seen what it is yet, but I ordered some tote bags for evening. So yeah, I'm gonna rip into this box right now and then hopefully I'm gonna be happy with the results. So yeah, let me open it please. They taped it up really well. Uh, put that away so I don't stab it. Ready, 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 guys, ready? Boom! Check it out. What do you guys think? Pretty sick, huh? I drew this myself. It says EM and there's hot stuff there and he's holding a can of paint. That didn't turn out too bad, actually. Check it out. Perfect little tote bag to carry your bottle of water or wax or tea tool or camera or whatever going skateboarding. It's like a canvas, heavy canvas tote. I think it's like 12 ounce canvas, cotton, I don't know. And it has these web handles which are apparently stronger than normal canvas handles. So yeah, this is the front right here guys. This is the back. It goes on like this and you go about your day. And you pull up to the park and you let all the boys know you're, you're in the evening mob. See, evening. And yeah. So these will be up on the on the uh, website pretty soon. Just gotta take some photos and stuff. And along with these new tote bags, if you buy one of these new tote bags, you'll get some stickers. I got some stickers made up, check them out, pretty sick. So yeah, you'll get a couple of these stickers when you purchase these tote bags. I don't know how many tote bags I got, but I got, I got like a decent amount, so. Yeah, I've been super keen on the tote bag idea because I use them all the time when I go out and skate or paint or whatever. So I'm really happy that I finally pulled the trigger on these because they turned out pretty dope. Is that your box now, is it? Have you claimed this box for yourself? So not being able to skate properly sucks. Like I found out I have a hairline fractured ankle, well I did. And I've torn some ligaments in my ankle from the from the uh, bail I had on Memorial Day. So that was a long time ago. My ankle's just starting to get better now, but it's not 100%. I'm trying to keep skating on it, but it just hurts. So I don't want to make it worse. And I'm really bummed out because I haven't been able to skate properly and I've been lagging on videos. So it's just playing in my head a little bit. But yeah, hopefully before soon I'll be back skating full-time or like skating properly again you know I just got to give it time so yeah I hope you guys enjoy these videos that I do I'm not sure like if it seems like all the videos that aren't really like completely skating skating don't do that well which is like whatever but um yeah to everyone else that's here watching and supporting thank you so much it means the world to me so yeah just bear with me while I wait for my ankle to get better I might have to change the content up a little bit but I'm just trying to just be productive and just keep pushing out videos and uh, uploading and stuff so you guys have something to watch so hopefully the right people will stick around you know what I mean like I don't want people to be like you suck you don't skate anymore and then unsubscribe like but if you do then whatever you know I don't care bro like I'm here making videos if you don't like my YouTube channel then you don't have to subscribe to it so I might even get some unsubs for this but whatever so yeah if you're new here what's up if you've been here what's up even harder and cheers for uh, supporting the channel and everything else. Yeah, here's my outro, guys. I'll catch you guys in the next video. Later.
This is the most dangerous spot of the fence to hop, as you can see. Come on! 